Well, just hours ago, families, organizations, religious leaders filled this church here to stand together with immigrants and speak about President Trump's executive order on immigration. Albuquerque is here for everybody, and that's what America is. That's why people are lined up with signs and kids holding candles. Are we going to again declare ourselves an immigrant friendly city? Are we going to make the commitment? That's right. We spoke with documented immigrants who say they're afraid President Trump's new immigration policy will tear families apart. I have kids and I really don't want to like move to another country that I don't even know. Laura Mendiola disagrees with President Trump, who says he's only tracking down undocumented immigrants with criminal records. Border Patrol is everywhere. They're knocking at the doors. They're taking whoever is there. I mean, he's not just taking people that have crimes or have done crimes here. Under the Obama administration, immigration officials targeted recent entrants and those convicted of serious crimes. Now, under President Trump's executive order, they can go after anyone accused of a crime, no matter how long they've been here. First, uh, Trump came after the Muslims with the Muslim ban. Now he's coming after the, the immigrant communities. And who is going to be next? And that's why the New Mexico Faith Coalition teamed up with community groups. Their goal was to educate undocumented people on what their rights are. We're live in Northeast Albuquerque. Justin Matthews, KYT Action 7 News. So